You must construct additional pylons. Welcome back, everybody, to more Five Guardians of David here on Additional Pylons Games. We're continuing a little bit after where we left off last time. Let's go ahead, get time back to, to my do boy. The Lord's bidding. Yeah, Joshua Beam. All right. Make sure we're nice and zoomed out here. And let's get it. Let's get to it. It has actually been quite some time since I have played Five Guardians of David, and I'm really actually looking forward to get back, getting back into this. Draw lion sand explode. What? Oh, exploring steer. Pole vault. All right, just want to make sure that I'm, I'm good. Spear slam. Uh. <laughs> good night, dude. Goodness gracious. Oh man. So it feels really good to be back playing Five Guardians of David. It uh, it's been far too long, and man, the the animations, just the the sounds of this game are really, really satisfying. Uh, let's go ahead and just pick up everything for now because I think that we have a very large amount of actually we can just go it's ahead and good to see you. Sell a bunch of all this, this white stuff um, There we go All right onwards onwards we go. Uh, who's this? Who's that dude? All right So last time we we scouted out the areas here with Ariella mm. Take it Archer all right, let's go ahead and poke him a little bit. Set fire to all there. <laughs> Knock him down a little bit. All right, take out this lieutenant. Lots and lots of poking. There it is. Shekel shekels everywhere. And yeah, looking forward to getting back into, ooh, let's go ahead and get in here, do that. Mmm, big slam. Lots of AOE going on here with Jasho Beam. So, it's just good to be back. It's it's real good to be back in Five Guardians of David. Uh, there won't there won't be a break on the channel, but it has been a good probably I would say two or three weeks since I last played this game, and that's just because I had recorded it a lot of it to begin with, and um, I don't know. So just letting you in on a little bit of a secret of how you know how to be successful on YouTube is doing a lot of batch recording. Let's go ahead and do some. I can't do that. Uh, uh, stamp. Don't tell me what you can't do. Uh, it, anyways, uh, batch recording is definitely the thing that that saves my channel. Um, the thing that saves, that makes uh, YouTube gaming manageable within all the other business of life is to do batch recording. And that is basically to record as many parts as possible at one time and then release them over time as you, as you go along. So I'm not going to do, you know, I try not to, no, oh, man. Sorry. Pathing. It's the only issue that I have with this game is pathing. I wanted to take that backwards path, that back path, and I, I can't. Um, anyways, let's go ahead and get in here. Yeah. Big slam. Oh, it didn't work. Apparently it doesn't work if they're already knocked down. Anyways, uh, so I've just been, you know, I've been doing other stuff for this channel. So recording other games uh, for the future. Recording. Daze him a little bit shekels get all that good stuff horn shield sure um anyways just been doing other stuff recording other games Ooh, get that cash yeah hook some stuff all right nothing like uh slaughtering a bunch of men um Ooh. <laughs> oh my gosh he just critted on all these guys and did like 5,000 damage. Jasho Beam! Ugh, ruthless. Savage. Goodness gracious. This is why, this is why Jasho Beam is my favorite. Let's go ahead and use our special ability and just do tons of damage. Lighten this guy up. This lieutenant doesn't stand a chance. Alright. Anyways, we got lots of tents to burn. Here we go, take out all these... Take out the camps. All right. It seems like these spear guys are doing some of the same attacks that I have. That's not cool. Jasher Beam is the only one who can be freaking awesome on the battlefield. Aside from some of our other characters. Anyways. So, it's, it's good to be back, though. Especially with Five Guardians. Five Guardians is just a really satisfying game. Mmm. 
kind of a miss there. But we got some bread. That's all that matters. Also, it seems like we missed a lot of... Yeah, we missed a lot of stuff over here. Um, yeah, whatever. Whatever, let's keep going. I'm not too concerned about it. Mm. <laughs> Gentle beam. Crushing them, boy. Crushing them. So yeah, Five Guardians of David. Yeah, it's an indie game, but the, the animations, the, the gameplay, the uh, sounds especially are a big one. They're just really satisfying. Uh, what you, oh, <laughs> he's our slinger. Um, sorry. I just saw him, I didn't really see him, like, throwing anything. I thought he was just there, just, like, waving his sling around or something like that. Alright, in we go. Daze them all, and then poke him in the face. Hey, level up, nice. Level 27, I'll take that. And this looks like the end of the road, but we got ourselves... Nice little cash. Berserker Rage. Somebody's got Berserker Rage. Alright. Explosive Trap. Ooh, jeez. Alright. Let's do that level up. Let's see what we got here. Slam is at max. Max, uh, Exploding Spear. We need to upgrade Exploding Spear, of course. My turn. Yes, your turn. Boy. Well, let's see here. What else can we do? We've got, uh, Retreating Shot. Yeah, let's get that up to max level. I thought you'd never ask. Eleazar. What do we want here? Oh, yeah. We definitely want these reeling hooks. This is a fun ability, actually. Throws out a bunch of hooks and it latches to enemies and Wise basically choice. pulls them in. Uh, max out on our armor sunder. Let's go ahead for leap slam. Upgrade that. And then, ooh, berserker rage. This berserk improving his attack damage. Stamina regen. Uh, I don't really use passives, and I'd much rather ha have him have Hammer Slam. For King hammer David. Slam! Uh, Trapper Net. Rooting multiple enemies for five seconds. Or Flip Shot. Um, you know what? Let's give, let's give, uh, Trapper Net a try. We'll give that a shot. Alright. Anyways, let's go Crash with Benaya. Yeah, let's have some fun with Benaya. With his fish sword or whatever he's got now. I have no idea what kind of weapon he's got. Anyways, we got some good slam attacks here with Mr. Benaya. We're going to have some fun with him. If we can get through this pass. Now is the moment. There we go. All right. Let's go back Wise to you, Benaya. Spinny. Spinny slam. Ooh. Big hit on the lieutenant to weaken his armor. And we'll take all his shekels and whatever else that he's got. All right. Let's go ahead and burn down some of these tents. Oh, they're all in a nice row for us. Lovely. Lovely, lovely. Make it so easy on us. Uh, big slam there from Benaya. Nobody does big slams better than Benaya. All right. Another cash. David secured Edom and the King's Highway. All right. So it seems like we're accomplishing multiple objectives here by uh, attacking the Moabites. It's what it seems to me. Yeah, big slam. Oh, goodness gracious. One to the face. That's all the nine needs. All right, Mr. Charger. I like this. Uh, boys go flying when the night. When Benai hits him. All right. Is that all? Return to camp. All right. We are returning to camp. I'm not sure what I just did there. Did I miss? I think I missed an attack. He ev evaded. All right, get these shekels. Shekels. More shekels. All right, check down this little canyon. Yeah, I thought so. There's a cache down there. Between Benaya and the two Moabite warriors, but it does not say why, when, or where it happened. Okay. Big slam from Mr. Benaya. Let's go ahead and use our uh, ability to take out a bunch of the armor for the lieutenant. Take him down a little bit easier. And big miss on the attack there, but 
Mm, jump slam. <laughs> That's another big miss. Jeez. All right. Spinny attack. And uh, wreck some pots just for good measure, right? Got to make sure that we hit our daily quota of pot smashing here in uh, Five Guardians of David. Guess what? What kind of action RPG would we be? Would this be if it didn't have pots to break? All right. Go. Let's just take all the stuff that we can get. Plate helmet. Ooh, plate helmet. This guy's bouncing around. Don't bite the berserker. There we go. Knock him down. Take out the lieutenant. Use our uh, armor weakening attack on him. He's down. Alright. Not really that good of stuff, to be honest. But we'll take it. We'll take the shekels. We'll take the bread. Take the bread that's been sitting on the ground for, you know, potentially bathing in the Moabite's blood. I'm sure it's just as tasty as, as when it came fresh out of the oven. Do, 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 do. We are back at camp. All right. So let's go ahead and get into it. They returned after decimating the Moabites. They're in good spirits. All right. We didn't meet Mesa. Themselves around them. Well, that's not good. King David, so nice to finally meet you in person. I hope you don't mind reusing your tent. The sun is dreadful this morning. Hmm. Massa. Ah, he invaded our camp. You have created quite the dilemma for me. However, oh, 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 now, David. Please, do not let this discussion devolve into something barbaric. This is your niece, yes? Shall I uh -oh. send her to meet the rest of your family? Not Ariella. Now you For starters. Are going to lower your weapons and surrender. We are all walking out of here and... <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, you don't mess with Ariella. She's, she's the best fighter <laughs> out of all the characters that we have. She punches pots and cracks them with her fist. She's practically She-Hulk. I don't know who these guys are, but David's calling in reinforcements, apparently. Benaya, bring me that man's head. Well, this ought to be fun. That got dark really quick. All right. Oh, it's probably a... Oh, it's a Benaya. Ah, it's a Benaya battle. Yeah, yeah. Let's do it, Benaya. Ooh. Ooh, okay. We got two guys going on here. All right. This guy does a lot of pokes. Can we knock him down? No. Oh, ooh, ooh. Let's get out of here. All right. Let's use our major ability, and then let's take out the... Ar let's try taking out the archer. Oh, that's not good. I can't do that. We're really just tanking this damage. I think that we've just given... I think that my uh, propensity to give... Uh, to give Benaya and Jesha being like the best armor and weapons is really paying off at this point because we are not having any trouble just tanking this damage. Let's go ahead and give it... Oh, okay, they're immune to knockdown. But we can keep using our big... Uh, hey, dude, come on. Big slam. Another right, evade. There we go. Alright. One guy is down. Let's go ahead and eat our bread. This... Really not too... Not too difficult of a fight. It's pretty much a tank and spank when it... Oh, he's... Is he regenerating stamina? Oh. Okay. Alright, well. Keep just using our big attack. Basically our number one. To weaken his armor. So yeah. This is really, I think that just because of the, the quality of the armor and weapons that I have given Benaya, uh, we're just able to kind of really tank this without a problem. So, not getting knocked down, not the best. But, alright. There we go, get some big crits. Actually, he's becoming harder and harder to hit somehow. All right, all right, come on. 
He's immune. He's evading stuff. I can't do that. That's not good. Come on. I can't do that. Don't tell me what you can't do. You're fine. Yeah, so he's healing there a little bit. All right. Just a few a few more hits here, and we'll be done with Melek. And uh, probably this level, too. There we go. Eight grand. Annihilate the Moabites. Ooh. Elephant axe. Wow. Horn shield. Got some plate trusses. That's always one of my favorite words. I'm not sure if I'm saying it right. Trusses. And uh, plate pauldrons as well. Go ahead and get some of this. Ooh, Melek's spear. That should be a good spear for uh, Mr. Uh, Mr. Jasho Beam. And then leave the wilderness. All right. So we should be heading back to town here. And then I'll sort out the items and such later. Yeah. Back to Zion. Back to Jerusalem. And let's see the wrap-up comic here that we got going on. With the defeat of the Moabites, the Moabites have been defeated. His vengeance against their king. It was time again for peace. The Israelite army was... They're ready to return home. I, I would think so. My brother. And I you, little sister. Oh, that's cute. Ways. Farewell and be merciful, my brother. Even as the Lord shows mercy on his people. Ah, Always. yes. Um, I believe that's... You have everything you need. Joab? Of course, my king. My men are just awaiting my orders. Yeah, because we've got Jasher Beam. Uh... Uh, oh gosh, I can't think of his name. Abishai Eliezer. No, that's Benaya. That's Jasher Beam. Ariella. Uh, uh, Ramallah? Ramla? I forget what his name. Mistakes. Shama. That's his name. Mercy. I have a length of rope per your request. Three men will lie down and be measured by it. I will put to death a man for wow. every two lengths and allow the third man to live. I leave it to you then. By your will, my king. This got real dark. <laughs> All right. Anyways, there we are. That's the wrap-up comic. So, we've defeated some big bad Moabites. We've uh, gotten vengeance on King Mesa. And uh, we saw, again, how unbelievably Welcome overpowered it is for uh, for anyone really to fight Ariella. You, it's just not even fair. Any news that we may have missed on our travels? Yes, oh. one thing of note. The Ammonite, the Ammonite King, King has passed. passed. David is to send emissaries to Rava in the morning to deliver his condolences. I believe he may be sending Ariella as well. That's strange. Why would he send Ariella? Anyways, we'll have to figure that out next time. So, thanks for tuning in for another episode of 5 Guardians of David here on Additional Pylons Games. Thanks for watching Additional Pylons Games. Click one of the boxes to watch another video and click the circle to subscribe and join the APG Zealots. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like and share it with your friends. Comment below and I'll see you next time here on Additional Pylons Games.